championship. Tony Canzanari in the corner at the right, the defending champion, and Billy Petroli coming out from the left. Canzanari weighing 132 pounds, 5 feet 5 inches tall. Crowding forward on Billy Patrol. Patrol, the challenger, 134 and a half. He's 27 years old. He's 5 feet 7. Patrol had difficulty making weight. Patrol was 10 pounds overweight 10 days before the fight. It is said that he's been weakened taking off those 10 pounds. Canzanari on the right, Patrol at the left. Canzanari charging forward with left hooks. Tony Cantonari with left and right to the head, and Patrol has to back off. The referee is Gunboat Smith. There's a crowd of 17,183 on hand at the Garden. Tony Cantonari, a stand-up fighter, keeps his guard low. His hands are terrifically fast. Billy Patrol fights in the Dempsey tradition, out of a crouch, bobbing and weaving. Both men just feeling each other out in this first round. Straight left jabs by Billy Patrol. Tony Cantonari advancing at the bell ending round one. This is the second time these two men have fought. Billy Patrol previously won a 10-round decision. That was before Tony Canzanari became champion. Canzanari is managed by Sammy Goldman. Canzanari became one of the youngest fighters ever to win a world's title, when back in 1928, he defeated Benny Bass for the featherweight championship. In 1929, Canzanari was unsuccessful trying to lift the lightweight title from Sammy Mandel, but the following year knocked out the then world lightweight champion Al Singer in less than a round in New York. The time was a minute and six seconds, one of the fastest knockouts on record in a title bout. Canzanari has piled up points here in the first five rounds. This is round six. Billy Patrol has a terrific punch. However, in making the weights, he may have lost some of the effectiveness. There, you saw that punch miss. Canzanari coming forward with rights and lefts of the head and backing off Billy Patrol. Note how low Canzanari keeps his guard. But he can, he's that quick. In 1931, Canzanari knocked out Jackie Kidberg in the third round to take the junior welterweight title. Canzanari only 23 years old, two times the champion. Canzanari has had 112 professional fights, scoring 29 KOs, winning 60 decisions, drawing in nine bouts, and he engaged in three no-decision bouts, lost 11 times. That's the end of round six. Tony Canzanari, the champion, ahead on points. As Canzanari coming out of his corner. They patrol, meeting him. Canzanari with that quick left hand. Billy Patrol trying to score that right cross, and Canzanari beats another punch. Billy Patrol, the Fargo Express. Oddly enough, he does not come out of Fargo. The Patrol family originated in Pennsylvania, at Berwick, Pennsylvania. He made his first reputation in Fargo, North Dakota, and consequently the nickname, the Fargo Express. Billy Patrol is managed by Jack Hurley. And it was Hurley who taught him to fight in the famous Dempsey Bob and Weave style.
Philly Patrol going for the head and the body. Philly Patrol, that straight left hand. He hooks and jabs beautifully, does Billy Patrol. Tony Cantoneri, upright. Patrol on that half crouch. Good right cross by Tony Cantoneri. Patrol backing off. A left hook by Cantoneri. A right cross and a left combination by Cantoneri. And Cantoneri has the edge here in the eighth round. Cantoneri very quick, but careful. Patrol has a terrific punch. Cantoneri now going after Billy Patrol. They have him in trouble, but Patrol is tough. That's the end of a good eighth round. Tony Cantoneri in the near corner. And here they come out for round 10. As the fight moves along, the making of weight for Billy Patrol begins to wear on him. Patrol advancing now on Tony Cantoneri, the defending champion. Good combinations by Billy Patrol. And Cantoneri is backing off. Watch the way Cantoneri fights back. Cantoneri with a good left-right combination to the head of Billy Patrol. And another straight left. Staggers Patrol. Patrol may be in trouble, backing off. Cantoneri coming in on Billy Patrol. Billy Patrol has had 150 bouts. He scored 61 KOs, winning 25 decisions. And Cantoneri is going after Patrol now. Patrol drew in nine bouts and engaged in 37 no decision contests. He was knocked out three times. this 10th round, both men are showing the effects of a long and grueling fight. But Tony Cantoneri seems to be the fresher. When they fought the last time, Patrol won through a split decision. Tony Cantoneri, a great counterpuncher, Drawing those leads, keeping his guard down. It's a good right cross by Cantoneri. Billy Patrol coming out of his corner for round 14. Gunboat Smith, the referee. Patrol knows he's behind on points. He's got to do something about it here and now. But Can Cantoneri is the fresher of the two. Cantoneri had no trouble at all making the weight. He came in on 132 and patrol at 134 and a half. Billy Patrol is one of the most colorful figures in the history of the lightweight division. He came down a ringside garb in a shabby Navajo Indian blanket, which always is used as his good luck charm. At this stage of the bout, he could use some good luck. Cantoneri ahead on points. Cantoneri welling away to the body. A good right cross by Cantoneri again. Straight left jab and a left hook by Tony Cantoneri. Cantoneri, obviously, the fresher of the two now. Dancing around, high on his toes. Welling away at Billy Patrol. Cantoneri using those ropes. Watch him maneuver along the ropes. He just fought his way off, beating Billy Patrol to the punch. Patrol's left eye is almost closed now. Cantoneri's quick jabs at the end of round 14. Here it is, the windup 
of a terrific fight between Billy Patrol and Tony Cantoneri for the lightweight championship of the world. Round 15. He slipped, throwing that left hook. No knockdown. Billy Patrol slipped. An indication, too, that he may be quite tired. And Tony Cantoneri going to work on the midsection of Billy Patrol. The free gunboat Smith separates the two men. A good right cross again by Canzanari. He slips that right cross over, over the left lead of Billy Patrol. And now Tony Cantonari holds on for just a moment. Patrol looking for that one punch which can win him the fight at this stage. Cantonari boring right in. Now they tie each other up. Only seconds to go in this grueling 15 rounder for the title. Tony Cantonari and Billy Patrol. the finest lightweights ever to step through the ropes going right down to the wire Canzanari leading with his right now and there it is the fight is over they congratulate each other Canzanari walking patrol back to the corner and we'll have the decision in the moment as Joe Humphreys getting the slips from the referee and the judges here's the announcement by Joe Humphreys indicating that Tony Cantoneri is still lightweight champion of the world. The winner, Cantoneri.